Welcome to the second part of a simple login sign up example. So this is where we left off last time. So let's go ahead and make some of the files. Now I'm going to create the sign up page. Sign up dot PHP. I'm going to copy all of my code, all of my markup, and now I'm going to create the sign up page. Let me give it a title. This time it's going to be SIG sign up sign up page. I just misspelled it. Sign up. First input is going to be type. Name is going to be first name and placeholder is going to be first name. input type text actually it's text my mistake and the name is last name placeholder last name it's first name and then sign up so this time we do not need this sign up info so let's take this out into the browser how does it look like sign up it's sign up dot php so the sign up page looks like this Let me made a minor change over here. Let me name it. Login wrapper. replace all so in the sign up I'm going to make sign up wrapper let's go back to our style sheet Let me copy this code. Paste. Find and replace. sign up dot wrapper. I'm going to replace this code with sign up wrapper. You can do it the way you want. I'm not explaining the best practices or the bad practices over here in this tutorial. It's totally up to you. You can alter the codes.
I'm gonna give it 300 pixels this time since the sign up form is a little big perfect so if I go back to my index page it looks like this perfect I think one one thing is remaining I should put this info I mean not the same info but the but a different one over here this time it's going to be please log in please log in here and this time the page is going to be index.php if I refresh if I click the sign up button I moved over here and there is another issue let me fix this issue I think I should not put please log in over here I should put this uh, outside outside this uh, wrapper I'm talking about the sign up wrapper it shouldn't be here I'm gonna put this outside the sign up wrapper if I refresh the page it looks like this all right let me go back and the navigation is working perfectly fine let's go ahead or and make three of the more pages the next page I'm gonna make is success.php soon you will know why I made this page profile.php I think it's fine let me make it log of dot php perfect right let me style this page success.php you are successfully authenticated
success info text line is going to be center padding top is going to be 200 pixels and uh, H4 perfect let me style this it doesn't look good right now so let me style this Success info and then the heading four tag margin top fifty pixels redirecting to user profile. perfect and here's the profile it has a wrapper and welcome welcome to profile and here I have an anchor link anchor tag log of dot php And then it's going to be log off. This time, instead of success info, it's header. I think I should put logo over here. Logo. Now it looks better. The content is going to be heading to welcome and it will be the user who will visit this page, who will successfully log into 
his account. It's profile.php. Profile.php. So it's already 50 minute tutorial. So I'll see you in the third part.